What's up everybody? The weekend is almost here and we are back with another video. We're back on the road. Yay! Check us out right after this. Adventures. They have a YouTube channel right here. So we're going to take you with us while we have a little bit of dinner in a little while. So stick with us. And if you have not checked out their channel, please do so. Again, that's Mark's Adventures. Yep. All right. See you guys later. I'm glad we're not heading eastbound. Look at all that traffic. I guess it's because it's a holiday weekend. Right, because Monday is President's Day, right? Jeez. And then, look at us headed westbound. We're good to go. Eastbound. Westbound. I think I'm happy we're going westbound. All right, everyone. We made it safely. We are here at the restaurant with Mark and Michelle. And it is Wood Fire Kitchen. Hello. Hi again. <laughs> All right, we are about to pick out our meal. So stay with us. See what we get. Thank you, my dear. That does look good. Alright, so this is an impossible burger. Vegetable based. My very first time trying. I'm not believing it. We'll see. It's impossible. <laughs> All right, everybody. We have made it safely to our hotel. Right, babe? We did. We had a, a nice dinner with uh, Mark and Michelle from Mark's Adventures. And it was, the food was great. The company was even better. Yes. And I got a nice uh, necklace from Michelle. She's such a sweetheart. And, <laughs> you know, they we actually met them last year. At the at uh, this show this that show. we're going to tomorrow. So this is actually our one-year anniversary. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So <clears throat> dinner was great, and then uh, we met him. We're here with another couple. They're in another room. We just left their room and yeah, had some they, good that's a, conversation. Uh, yeah, the Schweikerts from mm -hmm. down where we live. Yep. So everybody's here. We're settling in for the night here at our hotel, and we're going to get ready for the big show tomorrow. Uh, we've got some people to meet. We've got some of our subscribers who are out Yay. there who are waiting to meet us and Patty see and us. Victoria. Yep. <laughs> so, join us in the morning as we venture out to the Timonium RV show. All right? Okay. We'll see you then. Good night. Okay. So, you got to be kind of smarter than your hotel room curtains. <laughs> so, we come over here, right? And we're trying to <laughs> we're trying to close a curtain. We're trying to pull it down. It's not working. Like it's got to be a chain or something for it, right? So that's not working. So we go over here to the control, and duh, there you go. And this is what you have to do. And then. 
their curtain closes. Really? Fancy schmancy. <laughs> Headed to the show. said RV Expo 2020. I'm excited. I love these shoes. <laughs> you guys are ready to buy an RV? We're the proud We're ready owners to of a camper in 2020, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> it's freezing out here, but we decide not to wear our coats, leave them in the car. I'm suffering right now, but it's okay to be worth that it. anyway. <laughs> <laughs> It's actually a good idea to be honest. Jayco Pinnacle 36 KPTS. Starting with the outdoor TV. More ride steps. Coming inside. A lot of room on the inside. Dining table. 
There's two more chairs. With a there. shelf. You have your Thomas Paine. Look, it has the double um double lines. chairs, heated, <laughs> vibrating <laughs> seats, fold out trifold couch with an ottoman. Furion flip up television. Yeah, we, you, this is up to your standard. You're talking to a plumber. Uh, you like so that. Like Furion fireplace. Oh, yes. Your Furion stereo. More storage. Water and on the outside. Lots and lots of counter space in this unit. Get water on the outside and ice. Convection microwave. Look at this the water on the outside of the fridge. You don't get that very much ice in there. Refrigerator with ice maker. Furion oven. Double sink. Very nice pantry. We have a little area to put your coats. I'm going to move into the master bedroom with a king size bed. Large closet, washer and dryer hookup. This Jayco comes with another Fury on TV in the bedroom. Four door dresser. Now we move into the bathroom. Jayco Pinnacles are known for their luxurious bathrooms. Great vanity. Glass shower with teak seat, porcelain toilet, more storage. I'm sorry, Looking back down into the living room area. <laughs> we got an island. Okay, keep that in mind. All right, folks, that is the Jayco Pinnacle fifth wheel. All right, we're going to take a look at the outside of this Jayco. We have the Moor Ride pin box. Front storage already prepped for a generator. You put one 30 pound, pound propane tank in here. Lots of basement storage. Vacuum system. Furion outdoor speakers. Looks like this unit has a six point leveling system. Coming around back, we have the 50 amp hose electric wheel. This unit comes with slide toppers. Is the Jayco Pinnacle 36 
KPTS. It's the Ford F53 chassis. It's a Triton V10 engine. You know, that's going to be bye-bye next year, I think. They're getting rid of it. Are they really? The V10, yeah. That's why they built the 7.3, the big block. To, to replace it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or so I've heard. Nice. <clears throat> Do, but I'm not so sure we want to do a um, class A. Oh, this is we actually than a C. the thing that we and this is may may or may not be weird, but the thing about the class A is there's no airbags in them. Oh, okay. The class C has airbags. Okay. So for safety, I feel like an airbag would be better for an accident. Okay. Now, I know that's weird. But well, I didn't know, I didn't know that class A didn't have airbags. They don't have airbags. We found that out. Well, you know. Doing, yeah, shopping around. Class A's are, are built like travel trailers. No, they're built like travel trailers. Class C. All right, so right now we'd like to show you a Grand Design 3100 RD. This is a great travel trailer, especially if you're just starting out. Might be a little bit long, but still, this is a very nice <laughs> unit.
All right, just left the RV show. It is dinner time. Who let fresh cuisine or poulet? Don't know how it's pronounced. We'll say poulet. video we actually just did um, instead of going through all the campers we actually just took a video of three of our favorites a few of our favorites yeah a, a few of our favorites yeah um, there was one of them that we actually showed on last week's video a video that we showed which is the Alliance 370 FB that was my absolute favorite um, Mark from Mark's Adventures that's M-A-R-C-S can watch his video because he took a lot of footage of a lot of different campers and uh, he did a really good job. Yep, and you can check that video out right here. And it even goes all the way to the end where we talk about the food that we ate at Poulet Fresh <laughs> Chicken. We're assuming that's how it's really pronounced. Yeah. I have no idea. We think it is. <laughs> <laughs> so again, this was not one of our typical show you a bunch of uh, RVs and travel trailers and toy haulers. Okay, so as you saw or heard, someone started barking, so we had to put her in the video. <laughs> as usual. But we had a great time with friends, uh, and uh, Jeannie and Steve did actually pick out about three that they liked mm -hmm. at the show but we're not exactly sure what they're going to purchase. So maybe in the future, we'll get with them and we'll show you exactly what they have when they come down to see us at the KOA at Sunset Beach. Yeah, right I, I had a really good time. It's, I love looking at campers, even though I, I know we already have one, but it's just fun to see the new stuff that they've come out with, uh, the different floor plans, yeah. uh, the different options. I love it i could probably go to a rv show long bit as long as it's one like timonium yeah i can't wait to see hershey park i could go to hershey rv show sorry <laughs> hershey rv show um i could probably go to one of those about once a month yep i agree so we had a great time we hope you enjoyed this video we hope that you give us that thumbs up hit that like button right now and don't forget to like and subscribe. But wait a minute. What? You, right there, with the red shirt on. <laughs> you didn't hit the like button. I can see you. Go ahead. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> uh.
Oh, he's in. All right, folks. Here's hoping that you have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. weekend. All right, guys. We'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.